XCOM. Let's see here. There's easy, normal, classic. Ha 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 Oh no, the bottom is turned. I don't think I can make that gap now. Oh yeah, just force your way through like on I-4. Well. I can't believe I fit that. This game's re usually really bitchy about the uh, the hitboxes when you're trying to move around other units, especially your tank. Hello, Commander. In light of the recent extraterrestrial incursion, this Council of Nations has convened to approve the activation of the XCOM project. You have been chosen to lead this initiative to oversee our Perfect. first I got both those things down just in time because I'll just shoot. Your efforts will have and then I can kill the one radiator. And then I need to kill the other three. And kill all of the second radiator. But not before I get the third radiator to almost zero off. So I have to deal with Salvaria as little as possible. Good luck, Commander. You do that. Because five, five, five reasons. I actually need the Edelweiss to be on this side of it. I tell you, I made it to uh, tier four. That was the Arcane. last transmission, sir. So. Patch me through to Voodoo 3-1. I believe you did. I was pretty excited. Voodoo 3. You were being deployed to Germany. At 1900 hours Zulu, several unidentified objects fell to Earth. After ruling out the possibility of a downed satellite, we now believe these objects to be extraterrestrial in nature. Shortly after impact, German officials received reports of mass hysteria. Cool, I knocked the wall over. I didn't drop what I want on my own people this time. Then things went dark. At 2100 hours, Mr. Gorbachev, carrying a German military recon team, went down in the area after they reported being fired these walls. As you know, Germany is a member of the Council, and they have requested our assistance. <laughs> Our mission is to assess the situation on the ground, ascertain the current status of the German recon team, and investigate the extraterrestrial objects. Central out. Central, this is Big Sky. Looks like we found the crash site. Roger, Voodoo 3-1. Any sign of activity? Negative. <laughs> Nothing's moving down there. Okay. Set her down nearby. Aliens, what is this? <laughs> oh shit. You ready to do a G rift, bro? Is it an OG rift? E. Oh man. Uh, oh, hang on, this I go as well. Delta squad. Five reasons big timber saw. Here I know! Here I know! Here I am! See ya! Use the mouse to select the highlighted position and to move the soldier.
A soldier can move up to two times per turn. Okie dokie, let's do this greater rift shenanigans. I need to upgrade. I need to start upgrading my stuff. Delta two, your turn. Move up. Oh, great. We need to upgrade your gems. Gems. Yes, gem revival and other. Because gems are truly, truly, truly outrageous. For real though. Meters north of my position. Police vehicle. Roger. Proceed to the next vehicle for a better vantage point. I also. Edelweiss no, took a shot yeah. from the bat of this main cannon. Lip with a hundred health. I wonder if uh, my pets hitting them qualify for the gem. Because technically the damage comes from the pets, which belong to me. Whatever. Probably. Probably. I don't know for sure. They probably, well, well I, I would assume so, it's just damage, it just says damaging them, so it's, you know, uh, strength, probably from inside a structure. Thank you, Doctor. Delta, advance and infiltrate that building, and remember, stay in cover. Now, remember, stay in cover. What if I'm going damage against bosses and rift guardians? Sometimes I like to play it risky and not go yeah. to Yeah, aim of the stricken's really good. Yep. Not for this wizard build though, because they don't hit things that much. What's the max level for a gem? Is it 25 or is it 50? I love it when the tutorial tells uh, me where to no go. There's no max level. It's like really high. It forces you. The chance gets really low. So basically call it good at 25. Nah. Not even. 50 is like... Easy peasy. Well, it's like around level 70 ish, so that it gets hard. Like, well, I mean, I'd like to get it to 25 and then get the bane of the stricken to 25 because I'm gonna upgrade my bane of the object. Permission to approach. Bane of the trapped. Because, you know. Permission granted. Then get bane of the stricken up and then probably just keep upgrading the stricken actually. Talk to me, soldier. What is it? I got no idea what this thing is, oh. but I can confirm that it's no... Hey look, level 227. Right. Awesome. All right, Delta I leveled up at the same time. Keep moving. Huh? Okay, I leveled up at the same time. Inside. Delta 1, there's a window in front of you. Let's take a look. Oh crap, pylon. Looks clear. Oh, pylon OP, pylon OP. Delta 2. Right before I found a new floor too. Solid copy. Central, we have eyes on the target. He's armed. Copy Delta 3. Okay everyone, get into position nearby. But do not approach. Doctor, see if you can communicate with him. Tell him to drop his weapon. I will try. Hello. Können Sie mich hören? I don't know what it is about this area, but it always makes me like it. Oh, he appears to be in shock. Keep your eyes open, people. I don't like the looks of this. Delta no. Three. I know going up there is a bad idea. Carefully. It can't be Keep good. Put a grenade mind. in his hand. Don't do it, man. Nowhere to move and it's poison and fucking desecrator. You can move to a different channel if you want. Should not, uh... No! He's no! One is down. Central! Protecting fire for multiple x-rays! This guy's got me pinned down, taking heavy fire! Damn it! Delta 2, your flank 2. Find some better cover. 
All right, Delta Two. Weapons free. Get ready Let's to fire. kill this guy. One is fire. Two is Overwatch. Hunker down. One of fire. It varies per character. Bam. Nice shot. Delta Four, you're freed up to move. Get out of there and get into cover. I'm getting wrecked, man. I keep walking around corners into packs of fucking elites. Oh, it wants me to fire. No, it doesn't. It wants me to frag grenade. I'm pretty sure damage off of my sentries. Correct. Get ready for their That's hilarious. Look out, Delta Four. There's another one coming. Damage off your sentries, what? No. It's just you now, Delta Two. Mm -hmm. Let's tip the odds yeah. favor. Look around. I just hit like a two billion crit. Power pylon and convention of elements stacking. Oh yeah. Nice. Holy shit, these guys are wrecking me. These stupid bug things that keep getting nailed by their point blank machine gun bullshit. The little cigar bullshit, basically. Clear the bodies and uh -huh. head back to the Sky Ranger for immediate extraction. Uh, yeah, I've got like 20 million top this and I'm getting like instigated by him. Whatever though. took out a squad of our best soldiers. If you'll excuse me, doctors, the commander is waiting in mission control. Their technology is far beyond ours. Then I'd say our work is cut out for us, doctor. Welcome to XCOM HQ, commander. I'm Central Officer Bradford. My role in this project is twofold. Providing tactical support for our field operations and keeping you in the situation. My efforts should allow you to focus on the bigger issues at hand. Speaking of which, we have a soldier waiting for a promotion in the barracks. I'll let you get to it. Commander to the barracks. Commander to the barracks. Commander, the soldier is waiting for you in the armory which is located there in the barracks. Only one recruit from Delta Squad made it back alive from our last mission, Commander. And I'd say a promotion is in order. As you know, Commander, every soldier is different. This particular soldier has shown an aptitude for... Well, that time. As he gains additional combat experience, we should continue his training along these lines. This Isn't that a boon of the hoarder drop out of him? <laughs> what the fuck? The aliens won't know what hit him. I found a uh Oh. I found a gem of ease. You in the research labs, Commander. It sounded important. Hmm. Commander to the research lab. Hello, Commander. My name is Dr. Farlan. I oversee the research labs. This is where all of XCOM's research and development takes place. Is, we have already begun eight. analyzing the artifacts recovered wow, from all, the first Wow, all below 21% life while it's actually preliminary findings. Grids. We believe yeah. we can use them to develop some new Sorry. equipment for our soldiers. And I found a Marauder's position. With your approval, we will begin research immediately.
Happy fell in Marauder's what? Thank you, Commander. Marauder's finished. This helmet. research will take some time. We will notify you once it is complete. Commander to mission control. Commander to It sounds control. like you are needed elsewhere. Farewell, Commander. If you recover any additional artifacts during your field operations, I would be quite eager to study them. A one-handed weapon. Commander to mission control. The enemy is testing our capabilities, Commander. We've gotten reports of simultaneous attacks in two different countries. We can only respond to one. The country we help will donate more resources to our cause. But the panic level of the country we choose not to help will rise. It's not an easy decision, Commander, but it's one you'll have to make. Hmm. Who do I help? Do I help Baltimore? What are the choices? Baltimore, United States, or Beijing, China? Jim. I get more scientists if I help the U.S., but I get more money if I help China. Scientists are good. China is like what science? Uh, China's got some population to lose. I'll go with the U.S. <laughs> Understood. The troops are waiting for you in the hangar. Commander, before deploying our squad, you can choose which soldiers to send out there. I've taken the got my being in the trap to 23. Pretty soon, I get that OP slow aura. Damn it! So, uh, the reason scientists are good chemtry is the more scientists, the more, the faster you complete research, and research is really important. Yeah. Alright, who is gonna be Sanchez? It's gonna be... Uh, okay. Gonna make... This guy, TJ. You should make me a sniper, Kim J, and eventually get in the zone on my character. Right. Trust me. I wear a t-shirt that says, uh, I know what I'm talking about. Team. Fuck! <laughs> Got him! And you did get him, Goofy, but at what cost? The team! Complete badass. Your favorite color, Guppy? White. White it is. I'm a nigger. <laughs> White. I'm a nigger. Clint. Make myself very distinct. I'm not gonna be part of our squad. I am the commander. Huh. I thought that this was a problem with my older controller. But uh, apparently it's just a problem with Valkyria Chronicles. That bullet 
clearly went through his shoulder. Alright, I'll admit, it wasn't a kill shot, but it should have at least damaged him a bit. Alright, and this guy will be... You try holding a rifle when a 50 caliber bullet just went through your shoulder. His name will be Aaron Bontakun. Aaron Bontakun. That actually sounds like a pretty legit name. <laughs> Apparently, if I switch race, it switches helmets too every once in a while. That's funny. Okay. <laughs> You're gonna be a sniper, you said. So. E. And when you max my guy out, even if he dies and you remake me or whatever, eventually, when he gets maxed out, he has to get in the zone. For his key capstone ability. Alright, will you accept pink as your armor color? Sure. Okay. I mean, it'll help me blend in with all the blood everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Normally it takes two shots from a scout to kill anyone, but apparently you can kill snipers in one hit if you literally shove your rifle up their nose. Wow. I didn't know that. What, no? I don't actually know what the buff Tower Scout does. It might give me damage in case yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah, I have that sure. on my Witch Doctor. Except that's an ancient one. Broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there and eliminate any hostiles. I finally fucking got it. You gotta be fucking shitting me. Woo! The armor of all armors. Hold on, so I've been rolling for a specific piece of armor for a while. Your squad made us closer, so let him check it out. And I finally got it. Good. Now open the door. Quietly, so you don't reveal your position to the enemy. Okay. Now take cover inside. Alright, now I want a man on the roof of that building. See if you can find a way up there, soldier. Okay, it does in fact stop the sniper bullet. You can't collateral someone with a sniper rifle in this game. You can't with the shock trooper weapon, though. Because it's basically a P90. Brenna, I did it. Brenna, are you there? Get a wireless adapter thingy so I can literally have my computer on the left. Alright, Gopi, you ready for your first kill? And he missed! Okay, so apparently from here I can't fire the rocket. The captain said go big or go home and Gopi said well, I'm going Taco Bell. <laughs> it won't let me fire the rocket. You know why? Why? Uh, second move? No, I haven't moved yet. Okay, okay. Uh, I don't know. It's fine. I'll just, uh, switch to him and fire. Oh, I got the kill. Never oh, mind. We didn't even need to... Give it a shot, Clint through the window. Hey, Clint can't aim. Sweet. Still up. <clears throat> okay. Someone important though.
probably gonna take the shot again. What about the enemy guys? They're always like freaking Navy SEALs with their accuracy. And my guys are like ragtag group of farmers. Turned to promotion again. Fuck. Mm, a beast hill. Damn it! I fucked that up so hard just because I was trying to get the guy to TK. Wow. Man, I should have just shot him. But you can actually do that in this game because you know, like tanks and uh, anti-aircraft turrets or whatever will fire at you when you're moving. If you're really crafty about it. You can position yourself yourself with an enemy unit in between one of those turrets. And not only will he stop the bullets, but the bullets will damage him as well. So if you do it if you get the right setup for it, you can kill like two or three guys and not even waste your uh your own natural shot. Nice. Fuck, I lost my scout. I only have one other scout on the field, and sh there's no way she can get there. Because there's literally a fucking battle mess between her and where she needs to go. Engineer might be able to make it. This run's just gone Bring to hell. Needed. Speaking of which, what game are they running right now? I'm not sure. I normally have it open, but I didn't. I have it open, I just... It, it, my game's not letting me alt tab for some reason. Our veterans' rocket launcher should make easy work of the structure the aliens are using for cover. And if we're lucky, it'll take out the aliens along with it. That is, if it hits. Yeah, he didn't do it that good. Like, he can do it, but I don't think he's Torment 6 ready yet. I'll move, fire this weapon on the same turn. Maybe. Launcher, OP. If I may, Commander, the labs are on high alert. Teams are standing by for your orders. We got three out of the four kills. Did it? You? Your rocket oh, launcher at the end got a double kill. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds accurate. Montekun, who got the other kill, got uh, promoted. Oh, he got pr apparently your assault. Rip. Fine. No, uh, Bontakun is assault. Uh, not a sniper. So, uh, that's unfortunate. You're a British run and gunner. The recovered artifacts are being unloaded, and the research team is waiting your orders. We'll get started as soon as you give the order, Commander. Commander. We have an incoming transmission from the Council. Hello, Commander. We wish to congratulate you. I want to say one of my characters just got smashed by the bad of us, but there's a cutscene going on, so I can't tell yet. In responding to the various requests for assistance, 
Regardless, you performed admirably. As agreed upon, the reward for your actions has been granted. Farewell, Commander. We hope that you are met with continued success. Ooh, those are heavy as fuck! Oh, cool. It just knocked her out of the way. The council knows I was almost nice certain it would insta-kill. With the resources we have available, there's only so much we can do. I got a whirlwind However, farm up and running. Our chief engineer did come up with something to help you keep an eye on things. It's a beautiful thing. The situation room provides constant monitoring of every member nation in the council. If we allow panic levels to get out of control in any given nation, they're going to withdraw from the council. Then they'll take their funding and additional support with them. The Council's overall confidence in the XCOM project is shown on the primary meter above the main screen, which Engineering has nicknamed the Doom Tracker. Healing when you're playing a character class where movement speed is a damage stat.